Hey guys, Daryl from Playcasters here, and today I'm going to be moaning about the Vanguard operation. Now I apologise in advance, if I'm a little bit croaky, my voice is slowly going. So, the first thing I did when Operation Vanguard came out was that I purchased these extra missions here. Now, I've got no problem with them costing more, because I thought I was going to get loads more missions, I was going to be able to do all these extra missions at the same time. Turns out that wasn't true, I was only able to do like a mission every four days, I think it is, and then each extra pass reduces the cooldown by two days, I think it is. I'm not entirely sure on that one. Um, but basically, I bought it all in one go. I bought the pass, I bought the two extra missions, and then I jumped in. I did, I think it was like two missions or something similar to that, and then that was it. So what was meant to happen is, because I bought these extra passes, I was meant to get like four missions at the same time. This didn't happen, however... That's fine, Valve did fix that, they retrospectively added in those previous missions. And then I found out that actually I could have just done the Weapon Specialist, done all of these easy, like, uh, missions, such as, it's just getting kills with guns. Whereas with the other ones, it's actually getting, like, wins on difficult maps, such as Cobblestone, Overpass, ones that aren't exactly easy to do in matchmaking all the time. Whereas these, it's, it's just win an arms race match for someone who's got aim. That's incredibly easy. I've grown up doing gun game experience. That's why I started playing CS4 gun game in Counter-Strike Source. Um, and then uh, there's actually no incentive for me to actually have these extra missions minus the cooldown. I would have still got this done in the same amount of time. Uh, I've been doing it as and when I can, so it's not like there's been extra things. And then to get the gold star, what I need to do is do this line first and then two extra missions to get the gold star. As simple as that. So what they could have done is maybe allow us to do these missions, these extra missions here, like quicker because they were purchasable, rather than make me wait in addition to doing my sort of weapon specialist thing, which I didn't need to do. Turns out this is the easiest. Um, it's a bit of a pointless rant, I know. If you're a fan of Playcasters, make sure you check us out on the sort of Facebook and Twitter feeds because we're doing a sort of like an advent calendar thing, um, giving away a few prizes, uh, letting you know when videos go live. Anyway, until then, I'll see you again soon for another CSGO tip series video very soon. Goodbye. If you enjoyed this video, check out another one in the series, and I will see you again soon for another video. Until then, check me out on my social sites, and I will see you again soon. Goodbye.